check in with our storm team meteorologist, Dave Nussbaum. You know, you're talking about rain all morning and already we can see the clouds parting behind nice. you. Yeah, yeah, break it up a little bit here. This is looking off to the east in Summerton. So uh, things are starting to dry out for Highway 78. No problems out there for you here. Downtown still socked in with plenty of clouds from our BJCC camera where temperatures are 60 degrees. Now there's southwesterly winds, dew point numbers dropping as dry air starts to build in. So Birmingham, Summerton, Jasper, Fayette, Tuscaloosa, Westward, we're looking pretty good. A few showers still from Clanton area there in Chilton County all the way through uh, Clay County, heading all the way up toward parts there of uh, Cleburne County as well, too. Anderson 64, some showers. Talladega 63, Alex City, Clanton in the 60s as well. But 50s from Coleman, Jasper, Tuscaloosa off to the northwest across the region here. And downtown drying out, looking pretty good along I-65 through town. A couple sprinkles again. You head to Calera southward there. And as you go farther there off to the east, that's where you're running into some rain. Piedmont, Jacksonville area back toward Anniston, Heflin, Munford, heading over toward Talladega, Waldo. Lineville still some showers back near Sylacauga. Again, all light rain, severe threat, never really got its act together here, which is good for us. But we're just dealing with some showers and not seeing any kind of severe weather anytime in the near future. Now our front comes through now. We have a clearing sky back to the west of us, and that'll be moving in a little later today. And you can see on future cast is that rain kind of moves out by 7 a.m. We we'll see the clouds moving out here 8, 9, 10 o'clock. We'll be at 64 degrees by then. Then as we get to the afternoon, we get it to the upper 60, 67, 68 for much of the area here for Birmingham. Birmingham to Brand area to Tuscaloosa, 63 Double Springs, on and on about 65 today. Lower to mid 50s here by dinner time, and as we head to 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock tonight, we're into the mid to upper 40s, a little lower 40s there over in Hamilton, and then heading into tomorrow morning. A couple clouds to the south, you'll be in the 40s, rest of us in the 30s, a little colder out there. We'll see some high cloudiness come in from time to time tomorrow, but otherwise kind of mostly sunny to part the cloudy, but a cooler day into the 50s, and the clouds will stick around here. I don't think we'll see much in the way of rain tomorrow, too dry but we are going to see this 30s returning for Saturday morning. Now, unfortunately, late Saturday into Sunday, that's where our next weather maker will come through. A lot of rain overnight and into Sunday as well before a little break Monday and another system next week. So it's every so many days we have these systems coming in. So you can see the rain really ramping up by 8 o'clock there Saturday night. We'll continue overnight here into Sunday morning as the system sits down to the south into Sunday afternoon. Starts to taper off once that system moves off to the east of us Monday. We'll see our weather starting to improve, which is some good news. So 55 for your Saturday again late today rain much of the day dry sunny will have those showers especially for church hours there so just be prepared for that and as we look ahead into next week there's the dry weather monday but notice the 50s stick around tuesday another front comes in 56 but it will turn cooler behind that one 50 on wednesday with some rain 